Okay, so this book began with explosive chili peppers. Um, I was uh, doing a story for Smithsonian Magazine up in Northeast India, uh, and this was their food issue. They had these super hot, world's hottest chili peppers. So I was reporting on this, and in the process of reporting, I found out that the Indian Defense Ministry had made grenades using the world's hottest chili peppers. They were using it as a non-lethal weapon, and I <clears throat> needed to go report on that. And I got there to this lab, and the guy said, well, you know, the peppers, the, that didn't really work. They were prone to mildew. Uh, but I said, what else are you working on? He said, yes, well, right now we're working on a leech repellent for the soldiers. And they were testing it. They were going down to the river, and they were rolling up their pants and putting one leg with the repellent and one not, and they'd go in. And, and I was like, that was this moment where I thought, military science is just not what you think it is. This, is, this could be a really interesting topic. So I wrote a pr proposal, uh, and I believe in my original proposal, I said I'm going to embed with the 4th Marine Dental Battalion, uh, which is the kind of thing you throw into a book proposal, having no idea if it's going to work out. And it didn't work out, um, which was okay, because Jill really wasn't that interested in the dentists. Jill was like, Mary, people like Navy SEALs. They're interested in Navy SEALs. Can you can you hang out with the Navy SEALs? And so I thought, all right, I'll try to do this. I actually called the Public Affairs Office for the um, Special Operations Command, and I'm like, hey, can I hang out with some <laughs> Navy SEALs? And they're like, Ms. Roach, these are all classified missions. This is, uh, the answer is no, flat out no. So I'm like, there's gotta be a way. I'm gonna go in the back door. What I ended up doing, I went to uh, Camp Lemonnier, which is way off in, in the boonies of North Africa, where all the, uh, counterterrorism stuff goes on. There's a lot of special operations kind of ghosts going in and out. And I went in with a diarrhea researcher um, because when you think about it, these guys are traveling around in places where, you know, you're eating unrefrigerated goat and unfiltered water and they get sick a lot. And you can imagine if you were uh, trying to go take out Osama bin Laden and you were struck with diarrhea, I mean, it could, it's sort of a threat to national security. Uh, so. I got my man, I went there, I fought the story, I got Jill, her Navy SEALs, and a lot of other fun stuff. Um, and uh, it's, it's been probably the most interesting book I've done 